welcome guys so in this video we are going to solve one problem uh, related to operations on the signal okay so this is a december 2016 question and it's a 13 mark question so you see sketch the following signals so what are the question means one is u of minus t plus 2 then r of minus t plus 3 then the third question is 2 into del of n plus 2 plus del of n minus 2 into del of n minus 1 plus 3 into del of n minus 3 and the fourth question is uh, u of minus n plus 2 u of minus n plus 3 okay so in the out of this four signal the first two signals are continuous time signal and the third one and fourth one it is said to be the discrete signal okay so you see here the variable is t so t means here also the variable is small t so if uh, the variable is t means that signal is called as the continuous time signal and here you see the variable is n okay this is also n so these two signals are discrete signal so for this problem is a combination of two continuous time signal and two discrete signals okay and the first question u of minus t plus 2 so first what is u u means you know it is a unit step signal so what is the base of this u of minus uh, t plus 2 signal unit step signal so the first step is to you have to draw u of t so you know the unit step signal it's a continuous signal and the unit step means you know the graph uh, you know the definition so what is unit step for the time t equal to minus infinity to 0 the amplitude is 0 okay at the time t equal to 0 the amplitude is suddenly rise to value 1 okay after time t uh, greater than 0 the amplitude remains constant as a 1 it is said to be the u of t okay so the first the base signal we have to draw it is a u of t and you see in the question u of minus t plus 2 okay so what are the operations performed on this variable t first this t is multiplied with minus 1 okay instead of t there is a minus t means what is the operation it is said to be the time reversal or time folding over here the time folding operation is performed and this t is added with one constant value 2 so what is the meaning either t is added with the two or subtracted with the two what is the operation it is said to be the time shifting okay but in this case there are two things there one is folding another one is a time shifting okay so by in which pro in which order we have to perform this two operation means so you see in the reverse direction we have to perform okay you see the last last one means what is t plus 2 the first step is to you just obtain u of t plus 2 okay so you just perform the time shifting operation first it is the thing okay in the reverse direction we have to do okay so we have to obtain u of t plus 2 what is u of t plus 2 so you know if t plus means it is a time advanced signal okay that is the time advanced signal means we have to shift this original signal uh, by the amount of 2 second to the left side. So for this signal you just shift it to the left side. This is the left side. So you just shift the signal to left side by 2 second. But what is the answer? That is instead of 0 the signal is occurred at a time t equal to minus 2 itself. It is said to be the time advancing. Okay. The original signal starts at a time t equal to 0. The u of t plus 2 means uh, before time 2 second okay before time 2 second the signal it will start but what is the meaning we have to shift this entire signal to the left side by 2 second so you just draw the same shape uh, for the time minus 2 the, the time minus 2 itself the signal amplitude is raised to 1 and after that it is uh, constantly 1 so it is said to be the u of t plus 2 okay uh, then we have to perform the minus t what is minus t we have to take folding okay the name of folding is the other name of folding is time reversal okay time reversal but what is time reversal for the step number this uh, u of t plus 1 answer we have to take fold so folding means you know so here in the y axis we are placing one mirror okay if you are placing one mirror means in mirror the left side answer uh, change to right side the right side answer is changed to left side about how the graph the interchange this minor minus 2 to 0 value is comes under positive side 
this constant one is comes under this side appa what is the mirror image of this signal like this okay so this is the uh, u of minus t plus 2 answer okay so the three steps we are following first we are drawing the original signal u of t okay then u of t plus 2 the last from last to uh, this direction left to right to left we have to proceed so we have to obtain u of t plus 2 then for the u of t plus 2 we have to take the folding okay that is the correct answer for the first question then the second question is r of minus t plus 2 but what is the first basic signal is there r r of t means what is r of t ram signal continuous time ram signal okay these are all the standard signal unit step signal ram signal rectangular pulse sine cosine all signals are the standard signal so first we have to draw r of t but what is r of t r of t means it is a linearly increasing signal for time t greater than or equal to 0 so up to time t is 0 the signal is having zero amplitude at a time t equal to 0 and after time t equal to 0 the signal amplitude is linearly increasing okay so this signal is said to be the r of t so first we have to draw r of t okay then the second step is to so you just see here uh, itself uh, there are two operation is that one is that is in the place of t minus t is there means it is folding and the t is added with one value it is called as the time shifting okay similar to the first problem here also there are two operation one is folding another one is a time shifting okay so first we have to perform which one means we have to uh, do in the reverse direction first we have to perform t plus 3 okay r of first we have to obtain r of t plus 3 what is r of t plus 3 it's a time advancing okay our time advancing means we have to shift the signal to the left side by 3 second but actually the signal starts zero but before 3 second the signal start but before 3 second mean what is the meaning in minus 3 okay minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 from minus 3 itself the signal is uh, linearly growing okay this is said to be the r of t plus 3 okay then we have to take folding up for the signal we have to take folding for folding means what is the meaning this positive side signal is changed to negative side and negative positive negative answer swap to here positive answer swap to here up if you are taking the mirror image means we will get the minus 3 amplitude comes to plus 3 and mean plus 3 answer is comes to this side up we have to draw this one okay this is the mirror image of the Uh, previous step so this is the r of minus t plus 3 okay then the third question so these two question the first two questions are continuous signal so the amplitudes we are joining continuously okay but the third problem it is a discrete signal so you see uh, the third signal it is a addition of some four components so what is this one del of n del of n is a impulse unit impulse signal what is del of n minus 1 this impulse shifted by 1 second and this signal gets uh, multiplied with the constant minus 2 similarly this is the shifted impulse by the second 3 second similarly this one is the shifted impulse um, shifted impulse uh, by the second 2 second okay so these are all the given uh, these are all the given data okay so here 2 into del of n plus 2 okay so but here this is not a n minus 2 this is a uh, plus that is 2 into del of n plus 2 okay you just uh, change here it, the given problem is 2 into del of n plus 2 okay so we have to convert uh, yeah, so the given signal is a addition of weighted addition of the impulse function means how to convert into discrete form okay i will tell so first one del of n you take so del of n you know del of n is having amplitude 1 at n equal to 0 so at n equal to 0 what is the amplitude of this del of n 1 okay appa you just uh, uh, write 1 okay under this one you have to put arrow what is the meaning of this arrow this arrow indicates this is the value at n equal to 0 okay then you see del of n minus 1 what is del of n minus 1 this signal is available at a time t at a time n equal to 1 okay Up at n equal to one, what is the amplitude of the signal minus two? Okay, so that's why comma minus two. Then uh, here del of n minus two is that del del of n minus two signal is not there. But what is the amplitude of del of n minus two? It is zero. Okay, you put zero. 
then del of n minus 3 so del of n minus 3 amplitude what is 3 so you just write 3 okay similarly you see here it's it's not a minus 2 it's a plus okay i am wrongly written del of n plus 2 but n plus 2 means del of n before that del of n plus 1 is there no so the amplitude is 0 then del of n my n plus 2 the amplitude is 1 you have to put okay so this is the discrete notation of the weighted sum of the impulse signal okay then for this signal you just draw the diagram about the diagram is so that is at n equal to 0 the amplitude is 1 at n equal to 1 the amplitude is minus 2 at n equal to 2 0 at n equal to 3 the amplitude is 3 similarly here it's a 0 and here it's a 2 okay so this signal is the uh, this signal okay this is the graph for this given signal and the fourth question is uh, we have to obtain u of minus n plus 2 u of minus n plus 3 so here the multiplication of two signal okay our first one we have to find out the value of u of minus n plus 2 and u of minus n plus 3 and then you just multiply okay the first one we have to obtain u of minus n plus 2 so what is u u means unit step so here n u of n so it is a discrete unit step okay our first one we have to draw the base signal what is the base signal u of n but this is the discrete time unit step signal okay in the first thing we drawn u of t it's a continuous signal it is a discrete signal so u of n you know for n less than zero the amplitude is zero for n equal to zero to plus infinity what is the amplitude the amplitude is plus one okay so u of n first draw uh, then in this thing there are two operation is there one is folding another one is time shifting but what is the which one we have to perform the first u of n plus two so what is u of n plus 2 this u of n signal you shift to left side by 2 second but you shift this signal by 2 second to the left side but here uh, this 0 okay in 0 this sample this sample and this sample you shift to here but the signal starts from minus 2 to infinity okay this is u of n plus 2 okay for the u of n plus 2 the next step is to we how to take fold okay since here minus n is there so you have to take fold but for the signal you just take fold means what is fold this plus signal you convert to here and this signal you convert to here okay but if you are redrawing we will get the signal like this okay and similarly we have to obtain u of minus n plus 3 okay what is u of minus n plus 3 first you obtain u of n plus 3 what is u of n plus 3 this u of n signal you shift to left side by 3 second this is 2 shifting okay here we have to perform three shifting so the signal is available from minus three to infinity okay this is etc okay dot 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 it's not ending signal uh, this uh, you unit step signal is having amplitude one up to plus infinity okay so this is the u of n plus three and for this u of n plus three we have to take a, uh, that a mirror image However, you just exchange the values okay so this is the u of n minus three this is u of minus n plus 2 okay what is the question now we have to multiply these two signal okay about this answer this u of minus n plus 2 multiplied with u of minus n plus 3 so you see these two answers okay but if uh, this is discrete this is also discrete but now at a time that is element by element you multiply since it is a discrete signal so at n equal to 0 what is the amplitude here 1 here also 1, Apa 1 into 1 at n equal to 0. If you are multiplying these two means, if you are multiplying these two answer means, so we will get at n equal to 0, here 1, here 1. So answer is 1. At n equal to 1, here 1, here 1. So 1. At n equal to 2, 1, 1, 1. At n equal to 3, here 0, here 1. Apa what is the multiplication of 1 with 0? 0. Okay. After that, in 4, 5, 6, 7, etc. Uh, here 0 here also 0 so 0 okay similarly in the minus 1 minus 2 here minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 up to minus infinity what is the thing 1 1 1 is there so 1 multiplied with 1 1 1 only okay so what is the resulting answer you see this answer is resemblance to u of minus n plus 2 so u of minus n plus 2 into u of minus n plus 3 the answer is u of minus n plus 2 okay so this is the answer for this question okay so here the first two thing is a continuous time signal, continuous unit step, continuous ramp. 
this is a discrete uh, impulse signal this one is a discrete uh, unit step signal processed unit step signal and uh, here we have to perform one uh, multiplication signal multiplication also okay so thanks for watching so please subscribe my channel for more videos